Bella Noir. Yes. This right here. You're in for a ride, my friend. Since the release of the update, I have been on an extreme journey. Wait a second. Let me just... Yes. 3800 attack. That's, of course, with the food buff. This is the perfect damage, pal. Can you see the potential? Like the thing on the top right of the pal next to the HP. That in the middle is the attack like the potential of attack the hidden stat or as we call it the individual value this is literally as high as you can get and of course you cannot get legend on bella noir sadly and you cannot get lucky i have tried believe me if you don't believe me well look 1036 bella noirs that i have bred as wild as that sounds <laughs> yes it is impossible to get lucky i have seen all the other stats other than lucky and legend and of course the other exclusives like lord of the underworld and divine dragon etc but you don't need those because you already have like siren of the void i think it's called which basically gives you ice emperor and lord of the underworld combined and yeah you can see the damage drop because the food buff is gone anyway so what is the substitute for legend the best i could find was hooligan you can get sadist but sadist reduces your defense which is directly tied to well combat so i would really really encourage you to get hooligan because well who cares about work speed for damage pals and yeah in terms of just being a powerful pal this pal is it is probably the strongest pal that you cannot ride yes that's the best example i could say why do i say that because if you can get a perfect frost alien knocked and by the way this can get to 3400 with the food buff if you can get the perfect frost alien knocked with as you can see a hundred attack instead of 72 attack on potential you will be absolutely a destruction machine because you can hop on attack hop off attack hop on attack and goes on until you obliterate the boss so yeah in terms of like the most powerful it's not the the most powerful but it it is the most powerful villain war you can ever make however there's something i need to talk about and i don't know if they intentionally did it and i feel like that it is intentional and that is is the fact that out of a thousand and thirty six Bellin Wars that I have bred and gotten, only thirty eight were males. Gender equality is cool, but that's not what I'm talking about. You can see just how difficult breeding would get when you can only have three percent to get a male. It's like I think 3% and a half or something like that to get a male. Which is, yeah, it doesn't change the fact that it is extremely fucking low to get a single male. Let alone getting a male that you can breed with a female that has 100 potential on attack and some passive skills that would be a good combination for another female parent to make it easier to make powerful children. So yeah, I don't know what they are trying to do and the reason I I think it's intentional is because well it's kind of silly but if you can see all the other pals look at the description it always refers to them as it it's darkened yes it's glamming however the only pal in the game that does have like a canonical gender is Bella Noir. She quietly gazed upon the world and her desires. So I'm not sure if this is why they intended it to be extremely difficult to get a male because well canonically it is a locked female so yeah i'm not sure i mean even this you can get a male by the way so yeah i'm still very confused but i think that's the thing this is a canonical female which is why it is extremely hard to get a male like imagine it just three percent chance 38 out of 1036 holy shit and yes uh, so these are just a couple of few warnings that this right here is the hardest pal to breed because by the way you can only breed pals that you have gotten from well boss drops meaning you cannot 
breed different pals to make this pal meaning ferocious hooligan musclehead you need to get them by completely 100% rng because you will start with a pal that just says siren of the boy and that's it maybe you get something else like you're a bit lucky and you get maybe like diet lover or something because holy shit i got a lot of that you still need to dig up those other passive skills from nothing complete luck and holy shit imagine getting a mail so yeah i really don't want to discourage you from doing it but it is what it is it it is gonna be very very difficult to get like a perfect bill noir but it is doable and i would really really recommend downloading the faster breeding mod the one that basically lets you use berries instead of cakes and can reduce the breeding process to one second so yeah i would really recommend this mod and it's a dot pack mod so you can just remove it anytime you want and it wouldn't crash the game i'll see if i can find it for you and put it in the description but yeah other than that i have no other vices this is literally the best i can say because the rest is basically rng so yeah good luck and that's about it oh wait 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 i was gonna say that's about it but i remembered last time when i was made like for stallion knocked someone in the comments was like why didn't you show footage of gameplay and yeah we we're gonna do that i, I don't want to make a part two on just footage that would get just like 10 views so yeah let's uh let's obliterate uh what is he called of course uh the one and only my favorite subject of all time where is he yeah you anubis come here boy so let's just throw her let her do her thing yeah why aren't you getting damage? Oh yeah, okay. It's just holy fucking shit. Wait, is that? Wait, what? No, so something is definitely wrong. Wait, wait, wait a second. She wasn't that powerful last time. I tested her on my own. Wait, wait a second. Okay, okay. There has to be a bug or something. There's no way. Did I return to tight? Wait, wait. Did I accidentally increase the pal damage or something? There's no way. No, it's literally the same. What? Uh, okay. Okay, uh, I guess if you have, uh, maybe, maybe it's the internet connection. So let's go to another boss. Yes, yes, it's definitely the internet connection. Let's go to Forstallion. What the fuck was that? By the way, the only reason I'm choosing Forstallion is because just like Anubis, I have a base next to them. So yeah, let's actually try it on a level 50 and not just <laughs> poor Anubis. What the fuck was that, bro? Do your thing. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> It's this attack. It's the one that does like massive damage. This attack kind of sucks. There is something weird about the uh, nightmare stare, like the active ability, partner ability, I mean, because I press it, but nothing happens. It says no target available, even though Frostalian is literally right here. Look, it is extremely powerful and nightmare stare is even more powerful. I just wish it works when I press it. The way you know it worked is, well, your character does an animation. Oh, it did not work. And by the way, the uh, the combat wouldn't be like this, by the way. I do think I have regeneration at maximum. So yeah, normally I would take away the pal and return her just to like recover some HP. But yeah, it's basically the same damage. It worked! Yes, now it's gonna do the thing. I'm not sure why it doesn't do damage after that part, but yeah. And I just realized the Frostalion we're fighting is 99 attack potential, which is probably something I want. Wait a second. <laughs> Come here, boy. Come on. Come here. Hell yeah. 99 and 99. Attack and HP. Okay, anyway, yeah. She's amazing. She's not the most powerful. I think Frostalion Noct is probably still the most powerful. And maybe on the next patch, Jet Dragon is gonna get the most powerful spot because of the missile thing. Having absurd damage. And the reason I say next patch, because uh, dragons don't have any paths that buff dragon damage like you know the who crates which buff dark damage so yeah i am certain that in the next big patch we will get some pals that buff dragon damage i mean i hope so uh, i really love jet dragon and yeah uh, that's about it